This is a laryngeal mask airway. It comes in a sterile bag. The laryngeal mask airway is also known as an LMA, or supraglottic device. It is used as an airway device in patients who require manual ventilation. It comprises a long plastic tube and a plastic cuff. The cuff can be inflated and deflated using a syringe via this port. It is inserted via the mouth with lubrication around the back of the tongue with the cuff deflated. Once in place, a syringe can be used to inflate the cuff and maintain a seal above the glottis, providing us with an airway. This end can be attached to either manual ventilation or a ventilator machine. Indications for its use are emergency and elective. Emergency indications include patients in whom we need to take over their airway due to airway compromise. For example, if they have a reduced level of consciousness or in cardiac arrest or respiratory arrest. Electively, an LMA may be used during a general anaesthetic for certain surgical procedures. Complications of its use include an inadequate seal between the cuff and the glottis. This can cause challenges and complications during the ventilation of a patient. Importantly, this is not a definitive airway because the cuff does not pass below the level of the vocal cords. Indeed, it is a supraglottic airway device. As such, patients who have a LMA or laryngeal mask airway are at greater risk of aspiration compared to those who have a definitive airway, such as that provided by an endotracheal tube. This will be discussed in more detail when we discuss the endotracheal tube. I've seen this tube used in emergency and elective situations. The emergencies as discussed, respiratory arrest, cardiac arrest, and in certain general anaesthetics for certain surgical procedures. In summary, this is an LMA or laryngeal mask airway. It is a supraglottic device comprising one tube and a cuff that can be deflated and inflated via this port. It is used to take over the airway of a patient in an emergency or in an elective situation, perhaps during certain general anaesthetics.